excuse oh, for this. No. He's almost hit the oh. Audi that was the intervention car. There's no excuse for that. That is terrible driving. See infinity. There it is. Simona by, and that's what happened. Maybe I mean, this will tell us. What? Oh. Who was that? That was Will Power. Oh boy. That was Will Power. This is. This is the accordion effect. Well, something happened. Look at Well, Power was slowing up to get his tires warm. Hildebrand wasn't watching where he was going. Oh, my goodness. Right over the top of Power's car. Uh, well, you know, it's hard to know. This is the first time I've seen it. Um, see, and he's walking straight into our car. You can see where the other car is. He's walked towards us on purpose. Um, that's probably the most blatant thing I've seen in a long time. Uh, if you watch most pit guys, they try to get out of the way of other people. Um, so that was a bit of a dick move. Green flag. And the green flag's in the air, and they put the caution back out because they still had safety vehicles on the track in turns one and two. What, what in the world? Why? What were they thinking? They got about three trucks still out on the racetrack. And somebody hasn't... Some guys haven't seen it yet. They say there is debris in the groove in turn one, and there it is. Is this a paper? Oh, please don't tell me it's paper. It's a piece of paper. But okay. see, again, just like what happened to us at Charlotte, it, it ha if it had a little shine to it, you look at it, how do you know for sure? Binoculars. Very slow car of Tom Chilton. I think Chilton had no drive, and we've now got a car with, at best, three wheels from what we can see, possibly two. Or is and it, here's the I replay. Think Ch has Chilton his right rear gone? No, I think he's just got no drive. And the replay. Oh! oh. Yep. That's why his right and wheel had gone. Orico de Jesus was unable to avoid him. And I think we may well see another safety car. A few moments later. Oh, boys, you know you're behind the safety oh. car. Jeez. Well, that is the end of Ivar Muller's race, and that is a red flag. Franz Engsler gets into the back of Ivar Muller, and everybody piles him behind him. You know you're behind the safety car. And that, I'm afraid, is unforgivable by Engsler and by everybody else who's gotten piling into the back of cars that are stationary in front of them. question that I would ask in either of the bunkers at Vodafone, Chains for the Lead or Jim Beam is, can we afford a crash? And the answer to that is no. no. Yeah. So look at this, they, they end up in the wall, it's game over. It's going to be game over for one of these contenders if they're not careful. They've got to get on wet tyres now. Oh no! He's in the fence! The Vodafone defense! Oh, sideways oh the car sideways all all the cars are loose down in the corner the track is wet it's gordon gordon michael walsh kevin 29 Harvey. car all these cars are wrecking because i believe it might be raining down there and the rain is Look, coming it's even raining. harder oh for pete's sake what a way to start this event for some drivers what a way to end it unbelievable they waved the green flag, the sky opened up. Harvick shower of sparks up in turn three. And now it it's pretty well pouring. Trying to pick up his first win for Newman Haas Racing. Green, oh, and a spin. Green, All green, in the start. Green, 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 and it includes Will Power. Danica Patrick spins. And you see Mike Andretti, he was complaining at the beginning of this because, and there's damage to Danica's car. 
Royce tracks probably just a little bit. That mist comes down. It doesn't take much. You called this. You said that was going to happen out there. Yep, and I, I, this is the worst officiating I've ever seen. Sorry, Brian, but this was bad, really bad. Well, we lost the car and we lost the lead. I mean, this is just, you don't do that. It was wetter than when they threw the yellow earlier and they threw the green. I mean, it's just... Uh, you came oh, down, you appealed to the officials. Correct? I tried, I tried, it doesn't matter. Oh, loose. problems on the racetrack. The 52. Bill Baird. Steve oh, more problems. Cars coming in, we've got accidents on the racetrack. That looks like right around a motor right there. The Lonnie motor involved. Numerous cars involved in this one. Coming out of turn number two, the problems started in two, and they continue on to the start of the backstretch. Unbelievable. Boy, the racetrack is almost cars. blocked right there. Unbelievable. That many cars would get in that wreck. The other cars, thinking they were going to clear it, get into this as well. It just always amazes me that, uh, you know, here's our big wreck, and cars are so far back, but they continue to pile in here. Watch, here comes a bunch of other cars that just did not slow down. Here's real time right here. See Bill Barry gets sideways and takes Steve Blackburn hard on the outside wall. And again, they're going to come on down the hill. And there's so much smoke there, too, Darrell. And you see a lot of guys trying to take evasive action. You know, Phil, they always told us that here come some other cars that just are just, just can't get slowed down. They always told us in the driver's meetings, if you get loose, crank it left and lock it down. Angsler across the line, or is it Menu that leads? It's Angsler still. Menu in second place. Third is Portero. Oh, and the safety car! Angsler blindsided around the blind corner, hits the safety car. Stationary almost in the middle of the road. Angsler's team, well, here he is. Look, he's doing 185 kilometers now. The safety car doing, what, 40? And uh, I'm certainly hoping that everybody inside the safety car is okay. That was a big, big impact. Welcome back live to Daytona, just in time for our sixth full course caution of the race. And there is the reason why the 51, oh, wow. not sure if this problem suffered by the Aston Martin, the 007 GTD car, is related. I bet it, it was. Serious right front damage. He's into that corner. Oh, there you oh, go. He's up the oh, road. man. Oh. So the 81 and the 51 had obviously got into it, and the 51 just drove right into the side of Brandon Davis. Very messy start indeed. Now, we certainly saw the lights go to green, so uh, the pace car hasn't got off the track. The pace car's not off the track, and they've showed the green light. Good that grief. is absolutely disastrous. Absolutely disastrous. The pace car, I didn't see the fact that the field had pulled... A drop behind the Audi pace car, and what we had there. See the intensity level coming yeah, up on these guys. saw Mike Wallace looked like he was going below David uh, Rudiman right here, but they ran up on a slower car. Wow. Yeah. What? Man. That's Kevin LePage's 61 that Carl Edwards went up across the back of. Oh, they, you see yeah. what happened here. This 61 was not up to speed, and uh, he was it's almost like, uh, you know, he, he, these guys moved over and didn't see him. Had no idea that he was coming out. You know, they did. I'm sure that the spotters up there saw him on the apron. They weren't expecting him to come and join back right in front of the leaders. That's just a very unfortunate situation and, and a mistake on Kevin's uh, part and his spotter. They couldn't see me coming out of the pits with this red and yellow race car. Uh, then maybe they need to get new spotters. Well, guys, obviously a very disappointed driver there. And all of those cars are cars that had made green flag stops prior to that caution. Boy, Brian Vickers, Dale Earnhardt Jr., that ain't going to work, boys. Vickers hard. Here we Kyle go. Kyle Busch, the dominant car of the day, in the wall. That was wrong. And That's 10 wrong. cars sliding, slamming into the infield. Jimmy that Johnson, totally uncalled for. Totally. I don't care who you are. Well, that was just wrong. Vickers puts a little block on him. And then... You be the judge. Danica Patrick into the wall, spinning back down into traffic. White flag White is out. out. This is the last lap of the race. The long yeah, dry yeah, spell yeah, for man. Kevin Harvick and Richard Childress Racing comes to a close at Phoenix. He slides to the finish line while they crash behind him. Keslowski threads the needle as cars crash to the checkered flag. I don't understand why they didn't throw the caution there. The car was losing a lot of fluid. 
Look at that Harvey. street. Look at it. See Harvey just power sliding through there. A lot of cars. Oh, man. Hmm. Kurt Busch hit a ton. Well, Ryan Newman took a couple of hard hits. 